Okay, class. Can you all do the 23rd Psalms for me? Yes. All right, 23rd Psalm. The Lord, Lord my shepherd, truly mercy, will follow me all the day. Tawanda Ware says being 18, mom was enough to motivate her to open three LaFleur County daycare centers. As being a child, having a child, I thought it would be something that I can give back to the, the community to let other young people know that even though you may struggle or have problems coming up when you're young, you can always give back and bounce back. Bright Beginnings Daycare and Learning Center was created to enhance the learning and development of kids. On an average day, the children can be heard reciting the Bible and even rehearsing Spanish. To see the kids having a solid foundation towards learning and they are able to be themselves and learn and explore more of becoming because they are our future. Tawanda's service goes far beyond the care that she shows to each child. In fact, her impact stretches throughout the entire community. She is also a community activist and I say that is that she's so heavily involved in the community. So she plays a major part uh, to the Greenwood Community Center as well as the community surrounding community. Deborah Adams says Tawanda is selfless and always looking for ways to build others. Just keep doing what you're doing, Tawanda. Life is what it is and you can always keep building yourself better and better. Tawanda's husband is her business partner and he has some advice for future business owners. I always remember the 5P is proper planning prevent poor performance. And what, what, with that being said is that once you set out to do something, always plan what's your next move going to be. And even when time to your heart, remember what you set out to do. And like Tawana said, you just pray about it, have patience, and keep pushing. Real problems, real solutions, real heroes. I'm Andronita Williams reporting for The Delta Gets Real. Thank you.